What up Fortnite fam? I'm Matt. Update 19.40 is here and we're gonna break it down in under 5 minutes. But before that, Season 2 of Chapter 3 is now right around the corner and if you want to improve in time then you're going to want to check out the Pro Guides website. We've got some of the best coaches around and they're ready and waiting 24 hours, 7 days a week to help you become the best Fortnite player that you can be. With that said, let's break down the patch. First and foremost, we're looking at the map to see if anything has changed this time around. The short answer this time is that nothing has really changed, but we do know that there are some changes coming over the next couple of weeks. Massive ravines are going to rip open across the map thanks to the IO's drilling, as well as some more small craters. An earthquake warning has also been added to the files, which clearly links to the rest of that. The season is almost over now, so it makes sense that Epic probably wouldn't want to add any new POIs to the season this time around. They'll likely be saving the big changes for the next patch. However, if you look up to the moon on Tuesday the 8th of March, International Women's Day, you'll find that the moon has actually turned into a big heart, so that's pretty cool. Changes to the mechanics of the game are pretty similar to the map changes. That is to say, there aren't really any major ones in this update. One of the things we know they're working on for the future, however, is a new clipping system which is currently codenamed Koala. This system will allow you to download an app called Post Party which will let you capture gameplay clips to share with your friends. The system will allow you to capture 30 seconds of gameplay in total, which is plenty of time to show off your best plays to your friends without the need for any kind of capture card or capture software. Okay, let's go over all the new cosmetics that were added to the game next. For the outfits, we've got the FNCS Chapter 3 Season 1 Champion, Halle, Zoe Clash, Leela, Mecha Pop, and then two Naomi Osaka skins, a standard skin and Dark Princess Naomi. Harvesting tools are up next. We've got the Pneumatic Pop Axe, the Beep and Boop, the Amethyst Fang, the Dazzle Daggers, the Snow Tooth, the Portal Forger Paddle, which has two separate variants, and the Royale Racket, which also has two different variants. Taking a look at the back blings, we've got the Hopper Buns and the Pop Pack. There are two new gliders, the Queen's Cloud Carriage and the Cursed Haze Board. Finally, the wraps. There's the Winky Paw, Sticker Em Up, Folk Floral, Snow Suited, and finally, per Aspera ad Astra. So yeah, that's kind of it for today's update. There wasn't really much in it, but like I said earlier, this might be the last main update of the season before we hit Chapter 3 Season 2. So we probably shouldn't have been expecting all that much to begin with. Remember, we've got the Spider-Man Wild Week this week, the Avian Ambush Week next week, and the Bargain Bin Week the week after that. I'll be back with the next update when it hits. It seems wild that we're already going to be in Chapter 3 Season 2, but it's right around the corner already. Pretty exciting, right? If you enjoyed this update breakdown, like the video. And if you don't want to miss the next one, make sure you subscribe. I've been Matt, this has been Pro Guides, and I'll see you in the next one.